Climate change is causing juvenile great white sharks to show up in places they've never been seen before. Juvenile great white sharks have moved approximately 373 miles northward in California between 2014 and 2020, into waters that were previously too cold for them to thrive. The great white shark is the ocean's top predator, and as warming waters have shrunk the species' typical range, the shift is upsetting ecosystems in areas like Monterey Bay. Kyle Van Houten, the chief scientist of the Monterey Bay Aquarium, said that we're able to document a dramatic rise in juvenile white sharks in Monterey Bay that started with the marine heat wave in 2014. Fascinatingly, after that heat wave stopped, it's still been warm and the white sharks haven't left. They're still here. The presence of southern sea otters means this is a significant problem in Monterey Bay. Juvenile great whites eat fish before graduating to seals and sea lions. It's thought that the apex predators learn to kill marine mammals by hunting and killing sea otters. In fact, since 2014, the number of sea otters in Monterey Bay has reportedly dropped by an astonishing 86%. Sea otters are a threatened species and very important for the California coast as ecosystem engineers, both in kelp forests and seagrass meadows, said Ben Howden. A study published in the journal Scientific Reports found that the area of ocean off of California's coast, with temperatures suitable for sharks, shrunk by approximately 5% since 2014. This has forced predators and prey into closer living quarters, and it is reportedly contributing to declines in populations of fish such as salmon. Kyle Van Houden, the Monterey Bay Aquarium's chief scientist and co-author of the study, told The Guardian that the sharks are not to blame. The sharks are not the problem, climate change is a problem. The sharks are telling us that the ocean is changing, and it's now time for us to do something about it.